Happy Friday. <laughs> What's today's a day off? I am not running today. What are you doing there, Sue? I'm watching YouTube video. <laughs> Vlog 104. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Welcome to the Wayne Report. <laughs> Okay, see, we know what we're doing. So here's what today's um, lesson is. Lesson? I'm giving lessons now? How to wash your car efficiently at the car wash. Well, really, how to clean your car the inside with the vacuum cleaner. I'm going to show you how to do that. Why? I don't know. Okay, so the first thing's first. Take... The first thing you do before you put your money in the vacuum cleaner before you do anything, we want to take all our excess garbage out of the vehicle. So in this case, I have some paper towels down here. There's a bottle. Oh, there's some paper. So there's some paper down here in a bottle. So the vacuum cleaner will work for five minutes on your $2.50. It's a ripoff. But in five minutes, you should be able to vacuum or your floor mats, your carpets, and the seats. Now, our vehicle mostly just has people in the front seat. Mostly just me in the driver's seat. If you happen to have kids, it may be hard to do it in the five minutes because in the back seat here, you might have a couple car seats. You have to take them out and you have Cheerios and, and shreddies all over the floor, maybe a mushy banana ground into the seat or something like that you're gonna have to sort of work a little bit it might take more than one deposit into the uh, vacuum machine so once you've collected all the garbage out of there the loose garbage I'm gonna take your mats you can see the back has been well dirtied you shake out the mats and put them over here to the side somewhere dry you give them a shake too it helps. Before we start with putting the money in, I'm just gonna take the hose, put it in here on the driver's side, because that is the dirtiest. And then I'm gonna put in my money, and then I'll be able to start. Uh, I would say, start with the dirtiest sections first, which is usually gonna be the driver's seat, or if you have the kids, it's gonna be the back seat, for sure. Money in. Hopefully I can do this in five minutes. Done the front and I've done the back. Now I'm gonna do the mats. And when the mats are done, I can give a quick run through the back. I'm being kind, I'm winding up the hose again. Um, a couple things you want to get though, make sure you get. When you're on the door here, get down there. Don't forget your seats. Any uh, seat pockets you might have, you can always get those. But uh, that's basically it. So that was less than five minutes because I had time to spare. Now you may have noticed somewhere I brought some paper towel. Well, this is blue towel or like paper towel. A rag is really good too, like a face cloth or a small towel and some window cleaner. If you go to the auto parts place, they usually sell um, some spray foamy window cleaner stuff. And that works really good for your windows. And here's how I do this. I start from the front window, I work my way down, do the dashboard, the instrument panel, and go down and get the console. So when one rig gets dirty and starts looking like this, just get a new one, and you keep on going. Bye bye, happy face. vacuuming and I've done the windows and everything else uh, in the dashboard front and back on the on the vehicle then the whole thing in 10 minutes but here's the bonus section you can do this is more the detailing or end of things but look at your door jams so they get kind of dusty and all that muck just take your spray it's gonna be dirty Take your cleanest dirty rag, 
stair at the top where it's less dirty. Just go down. Huh? Neat little trick. It's a little bonus. This isn't a full detail. This is just getting the uh, the big bits. You can do it even quicker if you do it more than once every three months, like me. <laughs> ah, crap. I threw out my receipt for the car wash. So if you're going to go through the car wash, make sure you hang on to your receipt as well. Otherwise, you go dumpster diving like an idiot. <laughs> So you might be asking yourself, wow, how does Wayne know how to clean a car so fast? And how did he know how to drive into a car wash? Well, here you go. A little known fact about Wayne that nobody cares about. For five years, I worked in a gas, almost five years, I worked in a gas station. Right on this corner, actually. But uh, I did, we did full service gas. We did, uh, obviously, self-serve. And we did, uh, I worked for a year in the shop. With oil changes and brake changes. And all kinds of fun things to cars that I didn't know what I was doing. And I also worked in a full service car wash, which was just like we did. We'd have cars come in, you drop off your car. We had, essentially we had five minutes to clean the inside of the car, two people, and then get it through the car wash and try and do that in under 10 minutes. So you get pretty good at it. Um, keeping your car clean once a week really helps make it quick unless you're like me and you do it once every three months. But um, it's okay. So that's how I know how to do the car wash thing. This is pretty. Like unicorn poo all over the window. Look how clean it is, eh? Um, actual automatic car washes like that, they, they kind of dull the paint and stuff like that. It's good to do it by hand once in a while. Do a little hand cut. Who cares? I'm not telling you how to wash a car. I will say this, if you're gonna go wash your car through the car wash, and you want it to look nice for the whole weekend, check the weather report. Because it's actually raining right now. That happens a lot. <laughs> yeah, no. Here we are. It's Friday night and we're, um, we're doing our bit to um, social distance and physical distance. These are our friends. We're Zooming, first of all, we're so hip. They all live in Ontario. They live in Ontario. We so have to be distant. We're as distant as we can be. And here they are now. Hi, friends. This is Hi. this is Scott. Hi. This is Aaron. Oh, hang on. There we go. And that's Corey over there. Yeah.